Hello everyone, my name is Johannes Schweifer. I'm a CEO and founder of CoreLedger, and with this video I want to explain our token warp protocol. You have most likely already heard about decentralized finance, acronym DeFi, and the token warp protocol is a special form of DeFi which allows you to create digital decentralized marketplaces. For example, if you want to integrate them into a metaverse application, or realize a global digital barter environment or create new financial products. Which problem exactly are we solving? Well, in 2017, there was a boom of tokens and assets. And at the moment, there are tens of thousands of different tokens in existence and most of them not really liquid. If you look for ways to trade some of them, then if the trade involves at least one illiquid token, then you will most likely not find a trade pair because maintaining an order book for illiquid trade pairs doesn't make much sense. So how does the token warp solve this problem? If you don't find a trade pair connecting the asset that you have with the asset that you want, then the solution is to look for trade pairs which do exist and which can combine in such a way that the result is the trade that you were looking for. Now, what is so special about the token warp? The special feature is that this trade here is executed in a single transaction and not as a series of individual transactions. And why is this important? Because if it is a single transaction, then it cannot break somewhere in the middle, which would be the worst that could happen. So it is either executed completely or not at all. And in both cases, there is no counterparty risk for the trader. And this is the big feature of the token warp, allowing you to create, for example, a global digital barter market, which would not be possible without blockchain technology and without the token warp protocol. I want to show you this in a live demo so that you see how it works. And for this purpose, we use the white label management tool. In the white label management tool, we see Swiss francs, the asset that, you, that I have, and the lemons, the asset that I want to purchase. And I click on buy. Here I can insert the asset to pay, for, uh, pay with and the amount, the quantity of lemon tokens that I want to purchase. If I click on search, then I see the results of the token warp search and different possibilities to trade. If I click on the tile, then I see um, the individual trade pairs that are combined. Here Swiss francs into US dollars, US dollars into some other US dollars. These dollars then used to purchase lemons. And I can do this for all these different tiles here and look for the one that pleases me the most um, based on the exchange rate most likely. Best exchange rate is on top. Let's just ignore it for the moment and use one with many trade pairs. For example, that one, click on trade. Okay, now the transaction needs to be signed and signing a transaction always involves the private key. College of Theos is strictly non-custodial, which means the private key is always under the control of the user and you can use any connected device in order to sign the transaction. And I'm using, for example, the white label app, our sandbox wallet. Here you can see that a transaction has been generated which needs to be signed. So under unsigned, this is exactly my trade. I click on confirm and enter the pin code as an additional security measure and submit the signed transaction to blockchain. Now the transaction is in progress and I can look on my asset overview and wait for the transaction to be confirmed and inserted into the blockchain. And Let's go back and wait a couple of seconds until we have enough confirmations. Then the screen refreshes automatically and we see that we successfully purchased 250 kilograms of lemon tokens with a token warp, which connected some assets in between that we don't even need to know about and created such a barter transaction. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you will also uh, enjoy the other videos that we are going to upload, which show more use cases for the token warp technology and college ideas. Thanks and bye.